Okay guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm here today to show you guys how I trim my hair. Um, I was gonna go to the salon and get a diva cut, but the lady said it was $155, and I was like, mm, I can do that at home. So I'm just gonna show you guys how I trim my hair um, when I notice that my ends are looking really dead and I need more life, so stay tuned. So I just want to start off by saying, first of all, my shirt is pinned up because um, these girls were going to be showing all the goodies and I did not want that. Second of all, I want to say that I am not a professional hairstylist. I trim, I know how to trim my own hair because I've done it before, but I'm no way a professional, so... If you want to try trimming your own hair, I mean, it's really not that hard. You kind of just look for the dead ends and trim where you think is necessary. But if you want to go to, to a salon, you know, that's cool too. Whatever you want to do. And I'm also doing this um, with dry hair. I don't, I've trimmed my hair previously. I've trimmed it um, when my hair was wet, but I saw this video of this girl trimming her hair when it was dry and I've done it before like that but I haven't done a lot so I'm just gonna try it dry today just so I know what it'll look like when it's in its natural state so what you'll need or what I'm using is like a few hair clips um, a pick I use to like make my hair fluffy and then some trimming scissors. I literally got these from Roses for a dollar. So you don't have to go spend like $50 on some shears that you won't, you probably won't really use that often. So I'm just gonna fluff my hair to make sure I can see all the curls. And just start to like separate it a little bit. See what pieces I want to grab. I'm actually going to put this up first. If you know me, you know I do not like hair ties that much and I'd rather use clips because it doesn't snag on your hair as much. So just note to self. Hair clips over hair ties, people. So I'm literally just gonna go through and snip the dead ends. That's as simple as it gets.
itself, it literally took about 10 minutes maximum. Um, <laughs> Like I said, I'm not a professional. I just kind of go through, trim off what I feel like I need to trim off. I may go back and actually cut off a little bit more just because my ends were super dead. But um, the good thing about having curly hair is that if you trim it and it doesn't look too good or you're not happy with the result, your hair is curly. So you're not going to really be able to tell that much. That's why I also like to trim it, um, you know, when it's in its because you'll know exactly what it's going to look like and if not you can go back and style it how you want so thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time